Jordan, you're here for your teammate, uh, decided to stay home, play at South Carolina. What was your feeling going into this? Did he give you any inside info? Um, I mean, not much. He's kind of level-headed about all of them. I mean, picked his choices carefully. But of course, it's always going to be good to be home and stuff like that. But he never really leaned anyway towards me. But he kind of kept his decision discreet. You found out today, just like when we did? Yes, sir. All right, let me ask you about the Spring Valley team. Obviously, you being a junior, you're rising up the charts. Uh, you're going to be a heavily recruited kid next year. As far as colleges go, right now, who's talked to you and who do you like? Um, my only offer is from Clemson right now, but I do have calls from like Michigan and Miami and schools like that. But um, the heavily interested in school is Clemson pretty much, and that's the only school I have like. Um, but of course, with, with your junior year coming up, that's all going to change. How good can you guys be? Obviously, you're, are you 6'8 now? Is that six accurate? 6'9, six nine, okay. 6'9, six nine, and then you got PJ and some other good talent around you. You guys should be pretty doggone good. Yes, sir. Well, I expect the state championship, nothing less, pretty much. Um, as far as this happen, him making his declaration, do you think that takes, just speaking, I mean, you can't speak for him, but do you think that takes a little bit of pressure off of him and now he can just relax and play ball? I mean, of course, it's probably been a stressful process as much as a fun one, but I mean, it's a process that everybody wants to go through. And I mean, I guess it does take a lot of pressure off now. Um, he doesn't really have to think about it as much. He can just focus on basketball. You pretty excited about this season? Of course. All right. Great to talk to you, Jordan, and we'll obviously be talking to you all year long. Thank you, man. Right, appreciate it.